Robo, yes. Are you frightened? No. <laughs> you may not be aware, but I am a skeleton. Skelly boy. You are supposed to be frightened. Ooh. Skeletons do not frighten me. Spooky, scary skeletons. Father, never have I heard a more disingenuous lie made even worse coming from you. It is no lie. Three percent of my body is already not but skeleton. Skeletons are the most agitating frameworks known to man. No, that would be the Imperium's legal framework. Please do not <laughs> tell me the Lex Imperialis has been fucked over. Reproductive organs have not been used to push our Imperial laws out the proverbial window, Father. I wish for the day to come when this pain ends. According to multiple passages in the Book of Judgment, you just broke 357 different laws within the span of those 11 words. Wow. So what you are telling me is that the humongous bureaucratic blisters upon this once fine Imperial musculature has managed to ruin my entire poor sweet Dictatis Imperialis through a case of galactic myotonic dystrophy? Define... Ruin. I am not going to define shit yet, Ben. Drop dead Pape not fuck off. According to approximately oh 511 gosh. passages in the Book of He Dungeons, knows it back and forth. From defining words uh, front, to imperialism front, gosh, high political back and stature forth. is punishable front by a five-day death sentence in a phosphex bath, as well as a summary kick to the jaw. By terrorist titanic signals, I have never written such laws. What the heck? That... Five... Five... Oh my gosh, that's... that's that, that's that's pretty oh my gosh that's uh five days that's pretty that's pretty cursed like oh dissolving like that where did they come from since the 31st millennium the book of judgment has continuously expanded upon the lex imperialis with the adding of new laws every single day Oh goodness no. How do you yes. keep up with that? What is the current growth rate? Approximately 100 new volumes are added to its number for every 100 day volumes? Enforced by the Adeptus Arbites, who serve as judge, jury, and execution. Peep my mods. <laughs> Those are my mods right there. Those guys. Here is my outdated copy of the book of It's Germany. outdated by a day. Oh. I sometimes use it as a support beam. It makes so sense. High voltage. Really, this is utterly unacceptable. Yes. So sorry, chat. I'm so sorry. I didn't know that was going to be there. Ah! No! Dang it! Why did they have to put that on there? Yeah, of course you knew. There was no warning. There was no warning. No, nothing. My poor eyes. My poor eyes. Wasn't ex I wasn't expecting this. Quickly, Rogo, make it illegal to make new laws. Time is of the fucking essence, Rogo. Go, 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 go. Good idea, good idea. Go, 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 <laughs> I am Rogel Dorn. <laughs> he looks so intimidating right there. You youngsters that making new laws is now illegal, per my father's wishes. That laws. is all. That's my favorite thing. Ah, yeah, well, fiddle fucks. I guess clown goblins are legal after all. <laughs> Fuck you, Magnus! <laughs> the install- <laughs> Wait! That's so fr- <laughs> That's rude! You called me a cloud goblin? Arrow Mage, thank you for the bit size uncalled for. Uncalled for. Uncalled for. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> so mean. Ah! Ah! Well, thank you, thank you. I guess I have goblin-like tendencies. Like, if you've ever heard me do my... <laughs> a cloud? I thought they said cloud. I was listening and not reading. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. The <laughs> of new imperial laws has now been illegalized, Father. Good. 
I lightly skimmed through this abomination of illegal doctrine, its claim that this entire code is my spoken word is about as ludicrous as an orc with a lexicon. <laughs> if I was forced to write down every single word written in this book, I would have had to postpone the Great Crusade by several millennia. Yeah, this that's a lot of words. True. Also, what is the material this book is made Human of? Human flesh. Human yep. <laughs> Disgusting. Fucking EW. It taking time is understandable. Even larger would be the volumes containing prior cases of unsolved oh litigations. If the arbiters are for whatever reason not legally able to smash the accused head in on the spot, it can take millennia for the judges to reach a conclusion for a case due to the contradictory nature of the Book of Judgment. Since all but civilians and workers are under the grasp of imperial jurisdiction, would said cases not run out into the sand due to the fact that humans usually die before reaching a thousand years of age? It sounds like, it sounds like um, uh, a Necron trial. They're like, yeah, normally it takes like centuries for us to get a trial together. But for Trazin and Orokin, it took them 12 years, which was a short amount of time. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you prefer being called the clown goblin over a sewer goblin? I agree. I, I don't want to be a sewer goblin. I don't want to be a sewer goblin. No. Why the fuck no. not? Judges will spend all their time scrutinizing a case only for them and the accused to eventually die. When this happens, the case is immediately passed on to their successors. Oh my gosh. And after several generations has passed, the case will reach a conclusion and a ruling is made. Justice being dispensed uh, by the distant descendants of the original trend. Oh my gosh. A massive waste of perfectly good time fives. And yeah, culture. I'd say so. How is anyone supposed to follow a law that is too incomprehensible for even a judge to follow? It is impossible. Oh my gosh. Father. Usually when I say that, I get a poorly constructed counter-argument that I can then thoroughly and violently defend. He said, no, it's bad. Arbiters wear buckets on their head. Yep. Have you noticed this? Yes. Buckets. It is funny to me. Having fun is illegal <laughs> in this imperial. This is Oh no. True. I'm gonna get arrested. I'm gonna get arrested. I'm having fun. 